What's good, everybody? I am Coach MJ, and today we're going to knock out some core. All right, so we're going to knock out, we're going to hit some abs, we're going to hit some obliques. I know it's an area that a lot of people really want to target, so I'm going to show you four moves that you can add to your routine to hit the abs and obliques. All right, so the first move we're going to do is what's called, it's a, it's a combination of a bicycle twist and a V crunch. So you're going to bring it to the floor. All right, so hands behind the head. So what you're going to do, you're going to start in, start off by bringing one leg in and bring your elbow towards that knee. So the opposite side, left elbow, right knee. Kick it back out, bring both in. Back out, do the same thing on the other side. In, back out. Twist, in, back out. Twist, bring it in. Make sure you focus on the abs. Kick it back out. When, on the twist, this is the obliques here. Kick it back out, bring it in, all right? So on this, we're gonna knock out about 20 reps. Twist, pull it. Twist, pull it, all right? So again, 20 reps on that. 20 reps total on each side. Then second exercise, number two, you're gonna flip it over. Get into the push-up position. So you're going to get in the plank position, body straight. You're going to reach towards your toes. You want a wide stance here. Reach to the opposite side. Reach. Reach to the other side. Now from here, bring your knee in towards your elbow. Knee in on the other side. From the start, reach. Back out. Reach. Knees. Knees towards the elbow. This, you're definitely getting the obliques. For the uh, from the diagonal angles that you're reaching, and of course you're getting a lot of core stability from the plank on this exercise. All right, so that's number two: plank with the toe reach combined with a diagonal mountain climber. Number right. three. This is called a double jackknife. So it's a little advanced, but if you have somewhat of a strong core, you can definitely do this one. All right, so you're going to lie completely back. Start with your arms over your head, legs straight. So you're going to start with a sit up. Sit up, reach towards your toes. Now from here, lean back, legs coming up. Then you're going to reach up again. Go back down to the starting point. Come up, reach, roll back, toes up, reach, back down. So the tension is definitely staying on the abs on this particular move. Take it back, reach, take it back down. Now on this one, you want to do between 10 and 15 reps. To get, make sure you're getting a really good burn in the abs here. All right, we'll do one more, just for demonstration. Reach up and take it back. All right, three. Then the last one is a combination of an up and down plank or a commando plank and jumping jacks. So it's going to be a commando. Uh, jack plank, uh, plank jack. All right, so you're going back into the push-up plank position. Body straight, core tight. Go down to your elbows. Come back up. Legs out. Bring it back in. Back down. Up. Out. In. A little, a little that people know. The hip area is also a part of your core. So the jack plank definitely helps work your hip. All right. So that is four exercises that is a killer for the core. Again, you want to go 15, 20 reps. Except for on the uh, double jack knife, you want to go 10 to 15 because it is, uh, it's pretty intense. So 
You want to do 10 to 15 If you want to go 20, by all means, take it up. I'm not here to hold nobody back. So again, four exercises for the core, for your abs, your obliques, and also the hip area, which is again, a part of your core. I am Coach MJ. If you have any questions about any exercises, need any tips, feel free to hit me up wherever you're watching this, whatever platform you're watching this. All right? Self-care is health care. Till next time, peace.